Welcome back. Ariana Moyer is here right now. Three things to tell us. They are the top three trending things on our website. Yeah, so we have an update on that Erie Airport in case you missed it. And then Mill Creek Police Department launched an app today. And then Mercyhurst and the letter G Howard. So on a Friday at the Jefferson Educational Society, we had a little update on the Erie International Airport and that push to bring more flights into Erie. And, you know, as we all know, the pandemic really hit those mid-sized, smaller airports and everybody's kind of moving to those larger flight hubs. So this spring, we added that third flight to Charlotte and it seems to be going well according to executive director Derek Martin even with those three daily flights the capacity average capacity is 92 percent and that just kind of shows the demand in our region and hopefully that'll kind of help us continue to bring in more and more flights fingers crossed exactly moving on the Mill Creek police police department launched an app to help residents kind of connect with them get that information alerts and even leave anonymous tips so the app was developed by tip 411 and you can download it on Google Play on the Apple App City Store. City uses the same yes, thing. Exactly yeah. and you can also get it on their website and they said this really enables people to leave those anonymous tips but also allows officers to respond to them and have those two-way anonymous conversation they said there's no way to figure out who is sending those messages so it is completely anonymous and it's a good way to get information. Wave the future. And then last but not least, if you were down at the Bayfront this weekend, you might have seen the Letty G. Howard sailing because Captain Will Sabatini said that Mercyhurst and the flagship Niagara League have teamed up for that kind of sailing class they do, Waves of the Past, Leaders of the Future. So yesterday they were kind of sailing around in the bay. Today they sailed out to Putin Bay, Ohio, and they'll be there for a little bit. And then once that class wraps up, the Letty G will be in the shipyard for a few days before those sail, uh, sail season begins mid-June-ish. Coming up soon. Yes. Another sure sign of summer, by the way, and wonderful to see the Letty G in the oh, water. Yeah. When we come back, our nightly chance to make you smile. Stay with us here on Erie Digital News Now. <laughs> 